Good morning guys and welcome back to another video. If you are new here, my name is Jasmine Eve and what is going on? Oh, okay, Katie. My name is Katie too and welcome to my channel. So I woke up and I was like gonna do like this whole aesthetic scene for you guys. But Katie wanted a fruit salad. She literally made us go to the grocery store just to buy fruit alone. So she wanted to make a fruit salad this morning. That's what we're doing. Cantaloupe, mango, watermelon. Cantaloupe, mango, watermelon, <laughs> and raspberries. Ooh, are those your favorites? Yep. I woke up super hungry for no reason, even though I ate a pretty big dinner last night. So I'm gonna make a quick breakfast. This is my breakfast for today. I don't know, I wanted to sit out here because it's really nice, but the overexposure with the sun is just crazy. And low key, I feel like the sun is burning my back. <laughs> I might have just fixed it. Ish. Only in the shade. Oh, my neighbors are over there and I know they're looking at me. Let me sit down. Because it's like you can see every single balcony like in our complex. The amount of social anxiety I have right now, but it's okay. It's okay. I Can't really see myself. I hope it's not too bright, but I'm just gonna sit on the floor and my avocado is literally freaking melting <laughs> Ooh, It doesn't look as beautiful as it should I'm gonna switch to my iPhone for the food because it does not look good on the camera Basically, I'm eating these like spicy Polish sausages. They're really good. They're not the healthiest for you. It's okay, because I'm gonna balance it <laughs> with eggs and avocado toast. You guys, I'm about to go and get ready, but listen to what Katie is over here telling me. What was your dream? Well, <laughs> we came to Mama's room and then and then mama was sleeping early okay. and then and then you didn't close go to the closet and then the rat was in the plant and then and then it was taking a nap really quick and then it was wait wait the, the rat was taking a nap really quick yeah and then they came and then they hear something and then they hear me and you and then and then they came and then they hear you said a minute <laughs> And you didn't go to the closet and I was screaming and then it came <laughs> now. Okay. So why did you do that? Bro, I she keeps asking me why did I do something in her dream and I don't know how to respond to this. Like I like she's so serious about it. I don't know, Katie. It was your dream. I wasn't really there. <laughs> you were there. You were sleeping. <laughs> I don't really know what I want to wear today, but I kind of know that I want to look cute. So I have all of my legging. Okay, well, mm, I need to do laundry, but I'm going to wear these ones. These leggings. You guys probably didn't know this, but I have my own legging boutique where I don't charge you $60 for some pair of leggings that everybody is selling. I charge you $20. Link in the description. By the way, we will be restocking fitness fashionist leggings this Friday. So hopefully we'll have enough leggings to constantly always be in stock. Okay, I think I'm gonna wear this. I do wanna wear something cute. So I'm gonna wear it with this top. I probably wouldn't wear it to the gym. Okay guys, I am gonna show you my fit and everything, but I'm just gonna say that I was trying to go for cute and casual and I might have gone overboard. What, what, oh, oh, oh. Okay, ready? What do we think okay this is just like a little much it's monday you want to feel good you want to feel just everything you know what i mean productive ready to go again do i look like you know i'm supposed to be going out yes but it's okay let's see if lulu says anything you're gorgeous <laughs> you're gorgeous <laughs> thank you what are you eating You don't even need a squat rack. You don't need Olympic bar. You don't need plates. You don't need anything. All you need is a pair of dumbbells or none at all. Like you can use dumbbells, 20s, 10s, whatever you feel comfortable with or nothing. You can use like milk gallons, like cans. You don't have to use dumbbells. <laughs> Ready? Okay, no. 
it's still gonna hurt no matter how much weight you use but i would say if you are just starting out and you are not really familiar with the move don't use weight my legs are so sore i worked out yesterday like i actually did these and i went a little bit heavier um i actually do it with like an easy bar like kind of differently so i wanted to show you guys how to do it like i've been doing bulgarian sweat squats since i was like 17 like i've known about them but i never really did them the right way and i see a lot of people do them really fast or um even me when i used to do them i would like not really feel it too much so you don't need any of this crap you can do this anywhere you want they say the easiest way to get into the bulgarian squat, squat, squat position is to put your leg down like this like 90 degrees and then adjust your front leg to however you feel like you need if you need to go out more or more in and you just go up and when you go up though you want to like press through your heel and basically what i do is i kind of like lean in to it and i only feel it in my butt like my upper booty and my quad a little bit so it's like that and you want to go like really slow when you do them or else you're not gonna be doing it right and i'm already out of breath i'm not even using weight or anything but it's gonna give you like a crazy good pump if you're doing it at home for your at-home workout you want to do like three sets of 15 and even then that's crazy just do however many you can so let me show you this like i feel like i already have like a little pump <laughs> so then same thing you go down just your front leg and i only feel it here And my face is already super sweaty. <gasps> it's so much harder once you add the weight. But let me show you the difference once I add the weight. Once I add the weight, it's like my body doesn't even know how to do it anymore. And everything changes. Okay, so I'm gonna use the two knees. Down. And then look down. Like, you wanna look straight, like a neutral spine. Have it like straight. Don't look, try to look at yourself in the mirror because you will mess up your form. But also remember to keep your shoulders back. It's really hard. So far the shirt is holding up pretty good. Like remember I told you that the sweat would be nice because it would like absorb it. It is working, it's working. And y'all don't see any sweat marks. But yesterday I decided to do Bulgarian split squats and I didn't even do them that heavy. I just did them with the 20 pound dumbbells. I think I did like three sets of 12 reps, which is a lot when you're using weight. But that just shows you like how effective they are. Like it doesn't matter how much weight you're using. You can even do them as a burnout with a jump. There's so many ways to do them, but like they all hurt so good. Like you don't even need a power rack. You don't need to go to the gym. All you need is a set of dumbbells or like anything, a freaking child. I don't know, books, a book bag. Oh yeah, put the book bag on your, like, your back with like a bunch of shit in it and then just like go down. That's, that's probably good low key. But you could literally start doing them today at home and your booty will be so sore. And it will like get that pump and shape. Just get up and do a Bulgarian split squat right now. Like if you're watching this video, just do five per leg and that's it. Like that's, that's all I need to say because it's crazy. Comment down below if you like Bulgarian split squats or not or if you've ever done them or just your thoughts on them because I love them. And I'll see you in the next one. Peace. Wait, 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 wait. okay. And if you like my leggings, my fit from today i will put the link in the description like i always do